negative 3 to the power of 4 means that I'm multiplying negative 3 by itself four times. Now, negative 3 times negative 3, if I just work on that part and just start off my multiplication, I'm dealing with a negative times a negative, which is going to always give me a positive result. 3 times 3 is 9. So I've got 9 times negative 3 times negative 3. Now I can carry on. I've got positive times a negative, and so that's going to give me a negative result because the signs are different here. And then I'm dealing with 9 times 3, which is 27. And that still has to be multiplied by the remaining negative 3. Now I'm dealing with negative times a negative, which is a positive. 27 times 3, that's 72. And so my answer here is whoa, not 72. Sorry, 27 times 3, that is 81. 81. Okay. Got it right now. Okay, so it's positive 81. So that is D.